I am Dr. Akhil Shrivastav and I welcome you on the daily weather briefing of India Metrology Department. Today, 12th August 2025, we will see how was the weather during past 24 hours and what we expect in terms of weather in the coming next one week. If we talk about today's highlights, then heavy to very heavy rainfall activity is likely at a few places over Uttarakhand and at isolated places over Himachal Pradesh during next 7 days. Isolated extremely heavy rainfall activity is also likely over Uttarakhand on 13th of August. Over Jammu, isolated heavy to very heavy rainfall activity is likely during 12th to 15th of August 2025. Also, there is a uh, likelihood of increase in the rainfall activity over East Central India and adjoining parts of North Peninsula India with a fresh spell of heavy to very heavy rainfall activity over Madhya Pradesh, Vidarbha, Chhattisgarh, Odisha, Coastal Andhra Pradesh, Rayal Sima and Telangana during 13th to 17th of August. There is also likelihood of extremely heavy rainfall activity at isolated places over Telangana on 13th and 14th of August. Isolated heavy to very heavy rainfall activity is also likely over South and West Bengal and Sikkim, Arunachal Pradesh, Assam, Meghalaya during 12th to 14th of August with isolated extremely heavy falls over South and West Bengal, Sikkim and Assam on 12th of August. If we talk about the observed weather over 24 hours, then heavy to very heavy rainfall with extremely heavy falls were reported over Jammu where Rayasi district reported 29cm of rainfall in 24 hours ending at 8.30 hours IST of today. Heavy to very heavy rainfall was also reported over Punjab, Himachal Pradesh, Uttarakhand, East Uttar Pradesh, Assam and Telangana. Heavy rainfall was reported over Haryana, Madhya Pradesh, Andaman Islands, West Bengal, Odisha, Bihar, Chhattisgarh, Coastal Andhra Pradesh, Rail Sima and Arunachal Pradesh. If you talk about the main synoptic system which are impacting India today, then there is an upper risk cycle circulation over North Uttar Pradesh which is uh, seen at the lower topospheric levels. There is also an upper risk cycle circulation over northeastern uh, parts of Assam which is seen in the lower topospheric levels and there is a trough which is a north-south trough which runs from uh, southern parts of Bihar to north Odisha in lower topospheric levels. Also there is a cyclone circulation which is seen over central parts of Bay of Bengal in the lower and middle topospheric level and there is a likelihood of formation of a, a low pressure area under, under its influence over west central and adjoining north west Bay of Bengal on 13th of August. There is also likelihood of it becoming more marked during subsequent 48 hours. There is also a cyclone circulation over north interior Karnataka and neighborhood in middle topospheric levels and there is a east west trough which then from this cyclone circulation over north interior Karnataka and the cyclone circulation over central parts of Bay of Bengal in middle topospheric levels. Western disturbance is seen as a cyclone circulation over North Pakistan and adjoining Jammu and Kashmir region in the lower topospheric levels. If we talk about the monsoon trough position, then the monsoon trough, particularly its western parts, it is passing through Batinda, Patiala, Dehradun, which is north of its normal position and the eastern parts is uh, thereafter running uh, towards the close to the foothills of Himalayas up to Arunachal Pradesh. If we talk about the weather warning during the next 7 days, then for today, we are expecting heavy rainfall, heavy to very heavy rainfall activity over Jammu and Kashmir, Himachal Pradesh, Uttarakhand in, and uh, in northeastern parts over Assam and Meghalaya. In South West Bengal and Sikkim also heavy to very heavy rainfall activity, Bihar and Natural Pradesh and natural places heavy to very heavy rainfall activity is expected. Heavy to very heavy rainfall activity at a few places also expected over Uttarakhand. We are also expecting extremely heavy falls over Jammu and in uh, Samarandas, Bengal and Sikkim and on Natural Pradesh for today. If there were other parts of Eastern India, then in particularly Odisha, Chhattisgarh and Jharkhand, we are expecting heavy to very heavy rainfall activity in Uttar Pradesh, heavy rainfall activity at actual places is expected today that is on 12th of August. If it about central India and the peninsula India, then we are expecting isolated heavy rainfall activity over Madhya Pradesh, Vidarbha, Telangana and coastal Andhra Pradesh, Rail Sima, Tamil Nadu, Kerala and in Konkan and Goa today that is on 12th of August 2025. For day 2 that is on 13th of August again heavy to very heavy rainfall activity is likely over western Himalayan region particularly over Jammu and Kashmir, Himachal Pradesh, Uttarakhand and in the adjoining plains over Uttar Pradesh both east and west Uttar Pradesh, Bihar and in southern west Bengal and Sikkim. Toward eastern parts heavy to very heavy rainfall activity is likely over Bihar, Chhattisgarh in, uh, and Vidarbha. In south peninsula India, isolated heavy to very heavy rainfall activity is likely over coastal Andhra Pradesh, Rail Sima and Telangana. We are expecting extremely heavy rainfall activity also over Telangana on 13th and 14th of August and accordingly a red alert has been issued. On 14th of August, again heavy to very heavy rainfall activity is likely to continue over Jammu and Kashmir, Himachal Pradesh, Uttarakhand and in parts of Uttar Pradesh. Isolated heavy to very heavy rainfall activity is also likely over Odisha, 
छत्तीसगढ़ कोस्टल आंध्र प्रदेश एंड तेलंगाना विद आइसोलेटेड एक्सट्रीमली हाई फॉल्स ऑन तेलंगाना ऑन फोर्टीन अगस्त एज वेल इन एडिशन टू डेट आइसोलेटेड प्लेसेस हैवी रेनफॉल एक्टिविटीज लाइकली ओवर आसाम मेघालय नागालैंड मणिपुर मिजोरम त्रिपुरा बिहार झारखंड ऑल्सो इन दिस सेंट्रल पार्ट मध्य प्रदेश विदर्भा इन मध्य महाराष्ट्र मराठवाड़ा एंड इन नॉर्थ इंडिया कर्नाटका साउथ इंडिया कर्नाटका वी आर एक्सपेक्टिंग आइसोलेटेड प्लेसेस टू रिसीव हैवी रेनफॉल एक्टिविटी ऑन फोर्टीन ऑफ अगस्त ऑन फिफ्टीन ऑफ अगस्त अगेन हैवी टू वेरी हैवी रेनफॉल एक्टिविटीज लाइकली ओवर उत्तराखंड एंड हैवी रेनफॉल ओवर जम्मू एंड कश्मीर हिमाचल प्रदेश पंजाब हरियाणा लेटर वेस्ट उत्तर प्रदेश इन नॉर्थ ईस्टर्न पार्ट ओवर अरुणाचल असम एंड मेघालय नागालैंड मणिपुर मिजोरम त्रिपुरा इन सेंट्रल इंडिया ओवर मध्य प्रदेश ईस्टर्न पार्ट ऑफ राजस्थान एंड विदर्भ आर एक्सपेक्टेड टू रिसीव आइसोलेटेड हैवी रेनफॉल एक्टिविटी वे एक्सपेक्टिंग हैवी टू वेरी हैवी रेनफॉल एक्टिविटी ऑन फिफ्टीन ऑफ अगस्ट ओवर उड़ीसा तेलंगाना मध्य महाराष्ट्र एंड कोंकण एंड गोवा इन एडिशन डेट एक्सपेक्ट हैवी रेनफॉल इज लाइकली ओवर इंटीरियर कर्नाटका एंड मराठवाड़ा एंड इन कोस्टल आंध्र प्रदेश इफ यू टॉक अबाउट सिक्सटीन ऑफ अगस्त देन आई शोट हैवी रेनफॉल एक्टिविटी इज लाइकली ओवर हिमाचल प्रदेश उत्तराखंड इन नॉर्थ ईस्टर्न पार्ट ओवर आसाम एंड मेघालय नागालैंड मणिपुर मिजोरम त्रिपुरा इन मध्य प्रदेश विदर्भा छत्तीसगढ़ एंड तेलंगाना महाराष्ट्र स्टेट केरला इंटीरियर कर्नाटका कोस्टल आंध्र प्रदेश एंड इन द गुजरात रीजन ऑन सिक्सटीन ऑफ अगस्ट ऑन डे सिक्स एंड डे सेवन वी एक्सपेक्टिंग एक्सपेक्ट हैवी रेनफॉल एक्टिविटी टू कंटिन्यू ओवर वेस्टर्न हिमालयन रीजन पर्टिकुलरली इन हिमाचल प्रदेश एंड उत्तराखंड इन सब हिमालय वेस्ट बंगाल एंड सिक्किम एंड इन ऑन सेवनटीन वी एक्सपेक्टिंग एक्सपेक्ट हैवी रेनफॉल एक्टिविटी एंड सेवनटीन एंड एटीन ओवर मध्य प्रदेश गुजरात रीजन ईस्टर्न पार्ट ऑफ राजस्थान मध्य महाराष्ट्र कोंकण एंड गोवा केरला इंटीरियर कर्नाटका तेलंगाना कोस्टल आंध्र प्रदेश छत्तीसगढ़ एंड विदर्भा so these are the main warnings which we are expecting uh, for next 7 days for any updated information uh, please visit our website that is uh, mosom.m.gov.in or uh, the regular social media handles of indian meteorology department will meet again tomorrow with similar kind of information till then have good time namaskar jai hind